Welcome, welcome, welcome. This is going to be for Virgo. This is going to be for week one of May. Virgo, 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 she my Virgos. All right, if you guys are new, welcome, welcome, welcome. Welcome, welcome, welcome. Virgo. Ooh. I feel good. All right. That's your current energy. Wee. All right. You're walking away from something in the past. You know, um, you're not letting something stress you out, which I think is great. So let's see how somebody else is feeling about you. Let's see how somebody else is feeling about you. Okay, that's a whole lot. All right. Let's see what you don't see coming. Let's see what you don't see coming, Virgo. Wow, these cards are talking. These cards are talking. Let's see your possible outcome real quick. Let's see what we're working with. Possible outcome for Virgo. All right. It's definitely keeping your options open when it comes to something. What is your past, current past? This could be yesterday. Okay. Um, it could be two weeks ago. It's whatever this energy is. So currently you, you turn your back from something that wasn't working. It's just you're looking for something more. I do feel like... Um, Totally not trying to be biased. I don't know if you're dealing with somebody like that, but this is almost telling me this this masculine is looking at you. Okay, so I'm getting a whole story, not even from the cards yet. All right. Um, someone's like, wow, I, I, I had some type of security. Like, it's like they're not even talking, telling you how they feel. Nothing like that right now. But there's something mutual. I mean, you guys clearly have something mutual here. So it's tough. You do have something coming at you. Um, this is somebody who, like, wasn't following their gut, their path, not speaking up, not telling you how they feel. And the possible outcome is this is somebody, you know, you, um, my Virgos, it's, you're keeping your options open something. This is, you might be a little confusion. I don't, we'll get to that. But to me, it's, it's like, you don't want to give up on something, but you're, not currently happy with the scenario either, if that makes sense. So let's see what's going on. All right, let's see what your uh, the past is, your current past. So you you do have a mutual connection with somebody. Um, so there was just something you weren't getting from it though. Yeah. See so you. It, to me, someone must have kept you on hold. They put more energy and effort into work. They weren't putting energy into it. They they weren't talking to you. They weren't being a straight shooter. You know, um, which is unfortunate because you 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 guys do have a beautiful connection. Um. So let's see. Virgo current scenario. Yeah, it's just something. It, it's just it's over. It was like toxic. This is mm -hmm. this is somebody too. Oh, I feel irritation with this death card. Frustration, irritation. It, it's almost like someone's frustrated with themselves that they blocked this connection. Cause normally this would be you 
no, here's the deal. This this is you. I don't want to confuse you. This is you walking away from a situation, no longer stressing out, okay? Because you're just like, you know, I I know I know my worth. I know what we could have had, yada, yada. This is somebody who didn't put the effort in and now is like, it's, it's almost like they were fearing something and it's almost like now they're like, they want to be fearless all of a sudden. Because to you, yeah, it's over. Blocked. Okay. I don't know if you blocked some type of connection. But to me, you, you know, you X'd out. Yeah. See, I don't know if there was some type of competition. You X'd something out of a situation here. With an, you might want to watch Taurus. This is a little similar. Um, but to you, it's, it's, it's dead and gone. Someone didn't appreciate your value. Because I, I, I can see it. Because this is how they're looking at you. Okay. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn, energy. Somebody has got a lot of value, a lot of worth. So what you don't see coming is an offer. And this is somebody who lied to you about something or didn't want to speak up, didn't want to tell you the truth. But this is somebody coming in with some type of offer for you. And that was judgment, okay? So this is somebody who pretty sure is passing judgment on themselves right now. That wanted to come out too. All right, yeah, this person is very unhappy with themselves. You know, um, they definitely feel like they missed an opportunity. This is somebody who has lack of, you know, courage. Um, this is somebody who loves you, though. So... This is also them rejecting something else and coming back around. Something, it could be just them themselves. Because this isn't you. They're, this is frustration, pissed. Like, and yeah, it could be you. But I don't. I don't see it like that. Could be. I don't know if you block them, but they're gonna come in with some type of offer. If someone is is unhappy without you, so to me, you just you know you're going towards another situation because you know you had something good because the eight of cups goes to the two of cups so I do feel like this energy is going to try to roll back around I don't know how you feel about that um but it's just like you're no longer stressing out which I think is great yeah see it's it's almost like you turn your back from a situation because somebody wasn't taking some type of initiative here in a situation and they're just like not saying anything to you can't believe I missed this situation is opportunity um they don't want to accept it's over and, and to you it's over so you might have to block this which I think would be extremely difficult for you um because there's still love but they weren't giving you enough you know which is tough so let's see what this possible outcome is. I think you're just like dating, looking at things differently. You're no longer fighting for something. Um, you're just kind of like, what's next? You know? So, yeah, you got this. You got somebody looking at you long term now. Well, this is you wanting long term. This is a possible outcome. Um,. So there might be somebody new in your life. You might be dating, going out. Somebody hits you up. It could be a Leo. It could be a Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. You're no longer in the energy of dealing with this or competition or battling anything. You're like, I'm not stuck. I'm out. You know? Um, this is somebody who is almost like not giving up on you. 
But to me, you're like, I feel like it's their frustration too, but it is, it's like yours. You, you have fearless energy, which I think is fantastic. You do have a really good outcome. This is either you dating somebody new. Well, this is somebody coming back with a more solid offer, and you you wouldn't see it coming. How he or she is feeling, any particular messages from he or she, any particular messages for he or she. Some of you might be starting... It's funny, I was singing too. Some of you might be starting a new cycle. I mean, there's a cycle that's over. But I feel like you're starting something new too. All right, it says this song reminds me of you. So yeah, I don't know if somebody's like singing, thinking about you. If you guys have that type of music in common, I hope that one day you can forgive me. I'll wait for a sign from you. That makes sense. So you blocked it. You walked. You're in a tough scenario. There's love. Okay. It's just, they weren't giving you, they weren't putting in enough effort. They weren't talking about certain stuff. Like they, they weren't like looking, they just, they, someone, they just, they didn't see your worth. Okay. Um, which is unfortunate. So there, there is somebody coming back around. And again, if it's not somebody, if it's not this person coming back around, then it's just you, you're dating, you're getting back out there because you know what you want. And it's like sometimes love is, you know, is, is not enough just because you have a mutual connection, you know. Um, and it just, it is what it is. But now someone's like, oh, geez, you know, like, man, I'm really seeing this person's worth. What was I thinking? I'm just going to pull a shits and giggles real quick. And you will find the extended on Patreon. All right, Virgo. Okay, it says you need a, you know, you need a big fucking hug. A big giant hug. So go hug a tree if you got nobody else to hug. All right. Um. Well, this is the universe being like, squeeze, I got you. All right, so... I will go over this in the extended. Let me just see real quick for you guys. In the extended, we'll find out who's who. You might just be keeping your options open, dating, seeing things, looking at something differently. But you're not you're not fighting for something. This is somebody who needed to... This is somebody who didn't appreciate your worth, male or female. But I do feel like it could have been somebody you were already with, Queen King. It's a, it's a court couple. Could be a life partner, too. Or it could just be somebody who's just more solid now. Somebody Because you were dealing with somebody who was detached from their feelings. Okay, and now they're looking at you like, Woo-wee, woo-wee, won't you want to take me on a scene cruise? You must have music with this person. Tell me about the death card real quick, because they they are, they're waiting for you. Yeah, see, this is somebody who's gonna come in and be like, whew. They they want they want to tell you how they feel about a situation. Okay. Or again, this is over, and, and somebody new is about to come into your life. But I do feel like it's your past returning, I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> they're like, shit, I missed an opportunity. What was I thinking? All right, I hope you have a fantastic week. Um, again, you do have you do have something good. It is you don't see it. You do have a win, okay? Um, there there is there is victory here. All right, and I love you guys. Bye.